What's up guys, I'm Harigama, welcome back to another episode, episode 39 of Pokemon Glaze Nuzlocke Challenge. In the last episode, we got another, our last gym badge, actually, I think from Silver. Yeah, we got our last gym badge from Silver in Evergreen Town. And now we have made it to some island, some abandoned island. What is it called? New Island. And, uh, well, shoot, it's actually pretty crazy. There's, I don't know what the heck is going on here, but uh, let's get a quick team recap for you guys. If anybody who's new or people still tuning in, thank you all regardless for watching this episode. But anyway, first up is Joel the Galvangelo, level 69, no Spore, Thunderbolt, Signal Beam, and Slash. Next up is Bangle the Arcanine, level 67, no Flamethrower, Extreme Speed, Flame Wheel, and Aerial Ace. Next up is Juwachi the Jirachi, level 68, caught with a freaking Master Ball. He knows Thunderbolt, Shadow Ball, Aerial Ace, and Psychic. Next up is Carly Shay, hey. <laughs> the Shaman, level 69, knows Psychic, Magical Leaf, Leaf Seed, and Synthesis. Next up is Wakiki the Dragonite, level 67, knows Outrage, Surf, Fly, and Earthquake. And then Pearl is right there. Sorry for Skype again, hold on. Alright, I have to pause the video and turn off Skype real quick. And uh, yeah, there's Pearl, but he's not a part of the team. But we do have Lapras on our team, which uh, he's in the box right now, so... Uh, oh, there's a Pokeball there. How do I... It's... Oh, I can get back here. Alright, let's get another Pokeball and a... Oh, another blank CD. We can get another TM from that. But I... Oh, shoot, I don't know what other TM I would want now. I already got Flamethrower and Brick Break. Shoot. We'll see how it goes, we'll see how it goes. Alright, but anyway, let's keep on going. Oh... Oh, there's a PC right there. We can get Lapis now. Let's get Lapis, and... Yeah, there's Lapis, just in case you guys didn't know if he is on the team or not. And uh, let's replace Pearl, and we'll have to get him out later. Whatever the heck is in here, I don't... I don't know what the heck is in this new island, but this is the only building that that's on the island. It... Mewtwo? I should have saved. Aw, oh, shoot, I should have saved. Are we gonna catch him? What? Yo, right. The message you received was not from the league, but from me. I know you harmed you. Hush! I don't care why, but you did. I called you here to show you what you did. Defend yourself as you may, and be prepared for pain. Oh shoot! So we're gonna have to, we're gonna have to battle Mewtwo. Ho hopefully he's like level 60 or something. What? He's a trainer? Mewtwo's a train. Oh, I see what's going on. No, this is personal now. You do not use my own team against me. This has gotten really personal now. Oh, heck no. Alright, well, we gotta battle our own team. This is actually really scary, not gonna lie, because my team is OP. <laughs> like, not gonna brag or anything, but my team is OP. So I'm gonna... I'm, I put Galvantula to sleep, so hopefully I go into Waikiki and Earthquake this Galvantula out of here. Consider he wakes up on the first turn. Okay, then. Okay, then. What? What is... Please don't use it. Don't use freaking... Okay, he didn't use Thunderbolt. That's good for me. So I'm going to be able to get off this Earthquake. And hopefully I can okay with this Galvan Galvantula. I'm not sure though. Because it's only regularly effective. I could have... Wait, wait, wait. Let's think about this. Mewtwo is actually a really... I heard that he's a really hard trainer. Galvantula... I could have like... Flame wheeled him, but... Since I use Earthquake... He might switch out into Waikiki. I'm going to out predict him to go for an Outrage. Oh, do it! You just did it! You just screwed up, boy! Get out! Played! Ha! Get screwed over! Come on, you better kill that Dragonite. You better kill that Dragonite. Ha! Get okay on the heck on out of here, you freaking Mew freaking Mewtwo! You wanna be me! You wanna be me! And now Wakiki's level 68. Not bad at all. Dang, his attack went up by five. All right, here comes Lapras. He has Ice Beam. What is super effective against Lapras? Is it just fighting types? Rock type is to shoot. I think Juwachi's the only one. Oh, Carly Shay. Oh man, this is really bad actually. Lapis has Ice Beam. That could hurt Carly Shay. But I hope Carly Shay can live an Ice Beam so I can Leech Seed and then just stall him from there. Let's Leech Seed. I outspeed it. I didn't miss the lead seat. Okay. Okay, man. Oh, I'm facing up against my home team. Facing up against my own team is actually really scary. But he, Lapras had, this Lapras has Hydro Pump. So the movesets aren't the same as mine. So that's actually really good for me. So yeah. So he missed the Hydro Pump. So that's good for me. It wouldn't have done anything against my Carly Shay anyway. 
Let's see how much Magic Leap can do against this Lapras. It doesn't do too much, but... Oh, he's setting up the rain. That might actually help me in the end. He might actually help me. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. But my synthesis won't do it. Won't heal as much in the rain. I, I don't think it will. But anyway, Leech Seed, you're getting screwed over, Lapras. You're getting screwed over. You don't. You're not cool enough. You don't have my nickname, so you're not as cool as my team. But that Lap. Oh, crit out of here too. Ha! Two Pokemon down. Only four more to go. I am killing my own team. This is just. This is just cruel, man. <laughs> this is just cruel. But anyway, next up is the Galvantula. Okay. I'm going to Bangle now and Flame Wheel. Since Flame Wheel, Fire type actually is super effective against uh, Galvantulas. And Ground types are neutral. I think. I don't know. Oh, but the rain. Oh, of course. Why would I do this? Hopefully, Flame. Oh, Aerial Ace. Oh, Aerial Ace. Thundershock. Lol. What's that going to do? Oh, okay. Then. Thundershock. Why don't you have Thunderbolt? Alright, Aerial Ace is not going to kill it. Okay, let's start Super Speed. Oh, it's Extreme Speed. Ha! Outplayed, boy! Oh, good thing I kept Extreme Speed on Bangle. Oh, that's really good. That's really good. All right, here comes the RK9. This is where Rain Dance helps me out right here. So I'm going to have to just come in and bop this. You think that Intimidate's going to do something? Eat this serve. No, you know, Extreme Speed, it's not going to save you. Not like it Not like it did to me. He knows he's, he's going to get screwed over, so he's just trying to get as much damage as he can. But no, he's getting outplayed, pro played. Here comes the Shaman. Good thing the rain is out. Hopefully Shaman doesn't have Leech Seed and starts trolling me. But let's flamethrower it. It's gonna sweet scent. Okay, let's see how much flamethrower can do. Can it okay with the Shaman? No, it does not. Oh, but I burn it! Oh, there you go, Bengal Soldier right now. You are a soldier. Let's let's use extreme speed against him. Try to use extreme speed against me. I'm gonna pull it back against you. And it's gonna not kill you. But it turns into swift. Good thing it wasn't raining. Oh, that would have been bad if it if it was raining and it used superpower or nat nature power, doesn't that turn into hydro pump or something? I'm not sure, but uh, last up is Juwachi. I could earthquake, yeah, let's go on earthquake it, even though is Juwachi special or physical defensive? I'm not sure, but let's earthquake it. What is Doom's desire? I'm looking that up. No, no, what is Doom's desire? That actually scares me. That actually scares me. I don't know what it does, but I heard it's... Okay, I'm looking that up right now. Doom's Desire. What is that? It's a move? I don't know, crud. Okay. Damage dealing steel type move. Uh, what the heck? Can I just kill it then? Double edge, you can take it. Wakiki, take it. Wakiki, take it. Yes. Yes. And that Juwachi is out. <laughs> I'm calling it Juwachi. That Jirachi is out of here, and I defeated Mewtwo. I defeated my own team without losing any Pokemon on my team. That's pretty good. Not gonna lie. Whoo, get outplayed, Mewtwo. Get outplayed. Who are you, Ash now? You don't you just have periods as your text? Get out of here, Ash. <laughs> or Red, I should say. Useless clones. I'll simply have to battle you myself. Can I just run? Can I just run? He's level 50 though, okay. He's just level 50. I'm gonna put it to sleep. I'm gonna put it to sleep. And oh all my hit Pokemon are healed up, I think. Wait, are they? I'm pretty sure I'm not gonna be able to catch a Mewtwo though. Let's see if my No, all my Pokemon aren't. But Joel they didn't even take any damage. Alright, let's see if slash don't crit. Okay, I can use another slash. Don't crit. Okay, woke up. It's gonna swift. Let's pour it. And let's try chunking a, a ball at it. Let's see if it can at least wiggle. If it doesn't wiggle, I'm just gonna kill it. Alright, wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Boop, 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 boop. Alright, it doesn't wiggle. Uh, shoot. Let's go to Juachi and Psychic it, actually. Or Aerial Ace. Nah, it's Psychic. It's not... It won't hurt. Oh, but I killed it off. All right, Mewtwo's out. <laughs> Not like I was wanting to use Mewtwo anyway. Screw it. So that was my big plan. <laughs> there goes my big plan right there. All right, let's go in and get Clam Pro because I think I might need him back to get out of New Island. But actually now, there's nothing else to do. There's nothing else to do in the Johto region except head to the Johto League now. So we're pretty much done with the Johto region.
yeah we're gonna we're gonna start heading on over to victory road now that's pretty crazy if you think about it so let's go over here and we need to dive yes sir yes sir all right cool Jodo seafloor so now let's oh let me use a max repel i think i have some still so that was that was a pretty interesting battle not gonna lie fighting up against my own team i don't i would never want to do that again <laughs> my team is monstrous it is so intimidating not gonna lie, but I, 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 I played him. It was just a matter of me outplaying Mewtwo. But anyway, we're back in Olivine City now. And so how do we... Okay, I need to, t I need to find a map. But first, let me uh, heal up. So I need to find a map, and we're going to start heading on over to the Indigo Plateau. If that's where we need to go. Hey, that rhyme. Alright, let's find a map. Or let's just, let's just act like we're going to fly somewhere. But not like we ever can. <laughs> All right, where's the Indigo Plateau? What the heck is Ref and Isle? So we went to New Island. Um, let me look up. I'm gonna pause the video and look up where I'm supposed to go now, actually, because I think there's something else that I need to do. So I'm gonna pause the video and uh, look up where I need to go, and uh, I'll see you in a bit. All right, guys, welcome back. And uh, I'm actually here west or east of Mahogany Town in the snow, and I actually got TM Dig. From this guy, you can't use dig on those divots without the night badge and evergreen. But you can also use dig to escape from caves without an escape rope. So I actually just taught dig to uh, what you call it to Arcanine, and uh, yeah, so Arcanine knows dig now, and I think I replaced it with I replaced Aerial Ace. Yeah, I replaced Aerial Ace because I can easily uh, teach that back to Bangle whenever I want to. And I don't know what the heck a divot divot is, but uh, I also taught. Who did I teach rock climb? Because apparently we have to we have to go through ice path, and uh, you need rock climb and maybe dig to get through ice path. And uh, so now we're gonna head on over to Blackthorn City. Now that's the next thing that we have to do. And uh, apparently there's another gym leader in Blackthorn City. So we haven't got our last gym badge yet. <laughs> I lied. I'm sorry, guys. I'm a liar. I cheated. I cheated. No. Nah. All right. So let's keep on going though. I think I have. I don't have a. Oh, the repels effect were off. Okay, I was about to say, I don't think I have a repel on, but no, I did. I've also bought more repels. So now let's use rock climb. Bengal knows rock climb. And let's go this way. <laughs> uh, shoot. Oh, don't tell me I need... Oh, no, okay. I, th I thought I was about to need a rock smash. I'm like, come on, is this like all the TMs now? Okay, so let's go this way and get this pretty item. Ooh, rare candy. I'm gonna actually use that right now. Give me that rare candy. Uh, let's give it to. Let's just give it a bangle. Why not? All right. So a heart. I also got a hard stone. Raises rock type moves. Yeah. And that's about it. Nothing much happened off of cam. So let's keep on going through ice path and see. We got another nugget. More moolah. <laughs> so let's keep on going. And we also now we made it to the end of ice path and now we are in Black Dawn City. I didn't think this was a thing, but anyway. Hey, like the ice path. Cold, isn't it? Yeah, it better be cold, otherwise it would be melted path. I don't know. <laughs> Did you know that Claire's cousin was a champion of the Kanto League? His name is Lance. Lance is Claire's cousin? What? We learn something new every day, I swear. Maybe you've heard of him? Well, no, duh. He's like, he's the second, he's the second best uh, character. He's my uh, second favorite, most favorite character in Pokemon. Next to Lance, or next to Steven. <laughs> my bad. <laughs> Huh, you, been, you seem like a good trainer. I've been looking for someone to trade with. Would you trade a Dragonair for my Ampharos? If only I had a Dragonair, right? But too bad I evolved it into Waikiki. <laughs> nah, but anyway, here comes... Alright, so let me heal up real quick. And, uh, I think I'm done. I don't... I think I'm done diving and surfing and waterfalling and all that. So I don't think I need Pearl on my team. So let me go ahead and get back my Lapis. And put back Pearl. Clam Pearl. Alright, cool. So now let's keep on going and see what there, what there is to do in Blackthorn City. Let's, oh yeah, so let's just go ahead and uh, move the leader and relearner. Oh shoot! $500? What can Joldick remember? Oh, I'm going through all mine. Fury Cutter, Pin Missile, Thundershot, okay. Yes, give up. Let's go to Bengal now. Bite, Roar, Ember. Mm, bite maybe, uh, nah. Let's go to Juachi now. Wish Confusion. I already have Double Edge. Ooh. 
double edge though. Doom desire. Okay, never mind. All right, let's go through. I'm just gonna go through everybody and see if there's any cool uh, moves that I can relearn for people. Let's see. Let's see. Thunderwave Twister, Dragon Rage, Slam, Wing Attack. Okay. What about Lapis? Water Gun. No. Hydro Pump. Nah. I thought it was. It sounded cool. <laughs> oh wait, no. It was the move deleter I wanted because I wanted to. I want to rock Wakiki. Did I want Wakiki to learn freaking anything? I could have swore I've been I talk I've been talking about this. I've been talking about making somebody delete a move, but I just can't remember now. Well, shoot. Well, you can't remember everything, right? But let me go and search up everything because you never know what you can find in these houses, especially in this hack. Oh, didn't even know my rappel was on. All right, so I guess we can go inside the gym. That is actually Lapis's time to shine, so let's switch him in. And uh, yeah, with Ice Beam on Lapis, I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure I'm gonna own the heck out of him. So, but I don't want to speak too soon. I don't want to jinx myself. So let's just keep on going. There's nothing but Dragonites in here. Level 64. So that tells me uh, that tells me Claire's Pokemon are gonna be around level 68, pretty much my level. But anyway, what the heck is that? That was weird. <laughs> I thought that was like a little trap or something. Makes me fall into the lava or something. <laughs> Psych. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, no. Oh, Mr. Hydro Pump. Sucka. Oh, wait, wait, wait. King Joe's half dragon, half water. So ice isn't super effective against it. Is Thunderbolt... Is Thunderbolt super effective? I can't... I don't know if electric is super effective or... Is it only dragon that hurts... I think it's only Dragon that could hurt Kingdra. So I would have to rely on Outrage to take out a Kingdra. Everything else I'm pretty much uh, gonna Ice Beam the heck out of. <laughs> Especially the Salamence's Dragonites where they get four times soup. Okay, over. All right, let's keep on going. Oh, those spikes lower. Those are spikes that I'm walking over. And those spikes go down every time I uh, defeat a trainer. I'm not sure if I need it. I'm not sure if I need to battle all these trainers, but it's definitely more training though. Let me see. Oh no, I need to delete. I need to defeat all the trainers before I can even get to Claire. Okay, I get it now. All right, let me go do one last heal up. Well, no, nah, there's still one more trainer, so I'm going to do another heal up after this. Unless I don't take any damage, of course, but I don't think that's possible. But let's go check anyway. Bada boing. All right, I had to check something real quick. Sorry about that, but let's battle this last dude. And oh, he has Hydragons. So, okay, so what? Let's predict what Claire could have: Kingdras, Salamences, Dragonites, Hydragons, Garchomp, Haxorus. A lot of power. A lot of power. That's all I can say. And actually, with Hydragons, uh, what should we call? I can go into Joldic and screw up Hydragons, which is actually pretty cool. Yeah, I can actually go into Joldic <laughs> and uh, screw up my Dragons. As I, I've already done that before. Chibachi is level 69. Noise, noise. And uh, so, did I take any damage? I say screw it and let me just use a Moo Moo Milk. Why not? I have a plenty of Moo Moo Milks. And there is Claire, the, the official last gym leader of Johto, I think. But anyway, let's go. <laughs> let's talk to her. I am Claire, the world's best dragon master. You don't want to defeat my trainers, but trust me, I'm a whole nother ball game. You are another ball game. That's a little cock blocks statement right there, isn't it? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Alright, anyway, here we go versus Claire, the final Johto gym leader. Versus. Wait, versus. What? I don't know what I was saying. And he starts with the Garch Garchomp. She has five Pokemon, she starts with the Garchomp first. So let's keep on going, and let's just Ice Beam it. Okay, I was expecting Garchomp to outspeed me, but I wasn't expecting it to use Sword Dance. If this Ice Beam doesn't kill off Garchomp, Lapis might be screwed. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes, that was an a crit. There you go, Lapis. Lapis is, is like a soldier now. It's like he wants to be my, mo my favorite Pokemon. And he's level 69. Nothing better than that, right? <laughs> All right, who's next? Hydragon? No, it was Salamence. Okay, I'm going to stay in an Ice Beam. But Salamence might have a fire thing, thunder thing, something, maybe. 
Well, I don't care about intimidating. Okay, it's a gym leader battle. Do not super speed. What's up with them setting up? First freaking sword dance on Garchomp. Now a dragon dance on Salamence. This is scary. I'm, I just gotta hope that Lapis with a four times super effective ice beam can okay this Salamence before it can use its dragon dance. And it does and not even a crit either. God dang Lapis. I'm not even over leveled either. 69, 68. Not even over leveled. Here comes the Dragonite. Four times super effective ice beam. All day, every day. <laughs> and I think his... Her ace might either be level 69 or 70. So these are pretty high Pokemon. Pretty high level Pokemon, if I do say so myself. And three OKOs in a row. God dang, not bad at all. Alright, I'm ready for a Kingdra. Drudigan? Oh, Drudigan has superpower, doesn't it? But it's only Dragon type. Oh, this is scary. This is scary. Drudigan has superpower. I don't know if I want to... Who has... Who has higher speed? Okay, Waki... Or... Lapis has 109 speed. 109. He has 128. I'm gonna go into Wakiki and hopefully he can outspeed the Dread again so I can just outrage the heck out of it. That's the plan. That's the plan because I know no but no ja A shiny! Oh my gosh! Outrage. Yes, I outsped. Alright, cool. Because no dragon type can live in outrage from a Dragonite. This is not possible. <laughs> it's not possible. <laughs> but Drudigan, oh, that hurt. That hurt. All right, so next, who's last? A Kingdra. I'm staying in, and I gotta hope he doesn't have Draco Meteor. Please do not have Draco Meteor. Okay, I outsped it. I outsped it. Super effective outrage against a Dragon-type. And all their Pokemon got OKO'd. How about that? How about that? I wasn't expecting to OKO all that. I wasn't expecting it to be that easy. Her Pokemon were kind of scary because they were setting up, but if, it, if I didn't OKO her Pokemon, she could have probably screwed me up pretty bad. But my Pokemon are just... Ah, they got big guns. <laughs> God dang. I lost? I, 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 I need it. No, I was kidding. <laughs> Shout out to... Spongebob? <laughs> well, anyway, I got the rising badge. The other badges began to... Oh, the other badges began to gleam a bright gold. Bright glow? Gold. I can't deny how strong you are. The rising badge is your ticket to the Johto League. I got TMO2. What is that? Dragon Dance? That'd be cool if it was Dragon Dance, actually. Oh, oh, Dragon Claw. I already have Dragon Claw. Well, screw it. Listen, careful out there. The League is no walk in the park. Well, no duh. That's why it's the League, isn't it? <laughs> nah, anyway. Alright, let's keep on going. And now we can get a free ticket to Johto League, wherever the heck that is. I'm about to look on my map, and uh, what does our badge? What do our badges look like? It doesn't even show the eighth badge on here. Well, shoot. Map of Johto. Oh, I have a map of. What the heck? Okay, so. Oh, these are the battle pyramids. What? Okay. So okay, let's go ahead and. Fly, or not fly, check the map, and see where the heck the Johto League is. Oh, it's at Nubar Town. Duh, how could I forget? How could I forget? <laughs> Alright, so we just have to go south of Blackthorn City, and this is actually a new route we can catch a Pokemon in. Oh, don't tell me I need HM. Okay. Alright, this is Route 45, and we can actually catch new Pokemon. Not bad. I wonder if there's Dragon types here. Fracture, good thing I kept Lapis up front to ice beam these guys out of here. Ha, hoo, ha! Cool. So, uh, Route 45, I'm gonna go ahead and write that down if we can find a new Pokemon that we haven't caught before and that is, is not Duke's Claws or Species Claws, whichever one floats y'all boat. Alright, so Route 45, I'm gonna... Oh, I'm not gonna write it down just yet, but I'm just getting it ready before... Alright, here we go. What is it? It's a Glalie. We haven't caught a Glalie. We have encountered a Glalie, but we never caught it. So this is our encounter of Route 45. This is it right here. Glalie is it. I cannot catch any other Pokemon except for this. And let me ice. Oh. Should I ice beam? I'll ice beam. I'm gonna rely on Glalie's high defenses. Oh, I can actually 2KO it. Or not 2KO. I can actually hit it two times. And it should have killed. Shouldn't kill. Alright, good. Alright, he's using ice beam, so I can't switch out into Joldic and Spore it. Otherwise, it'll screw me up. So I just have to. Hopefully, the HP is low enough and Ultra Ball can do it. 
Or not, or not. Alright, come on. Let's just throw it up. Just get caught. One, two, three. Got him. Okay, so that last Ultra Ball was just a, def just a defected Ultra Ball or something. Just sucked. And then the next, very next one works. I don't get it. <laughs> I don't get it. But anyway, the face Pokemon. What the heck? The Glalie has power to instantaneously freeze moisture in the atmosphere. A dazzling cloud like diamond of diamond-like ice crystals form around its body. What did I name my Glalie in my black playthrough? That's what I want to know. I'm going to pause the video and check it, so be right back. Alright, I found my the nickname, and uh, <laughs> I would have never remembered this if I haven't had checked it. But <laughs> it's actually a pretty funny nickname. Glalene. Glalene. Lean, uh, you're, he's on lean. So I don't know. I guess that, that was... Uh, that's what I was thinking, apparently, at that time. <laughs> so that is our encounter. We finally got our Glalene back, which can add to the throwback if people are down to see a throwback for the third region. Is there a third region in this? I could have swore there was. Unless they took it out in this version of, of Blaze. But I, I am playing on the newest version. But uh, we'll see how it goes. Nigel. All right, let's keep on going. What, what is this? Dark Cave. We already got Dark Cave encounter. Haven't we? Oh, uh, shoot. Yeah, I, I wrote down Dark Cave already. So we can just put on a Max Repel and just go straight through this place. Where's the Max Repel? All right, there it is. All right, let's keep on going. And uh, we have to surf. All right, let's just surf out of here. Out of here, out of here, ha, 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 ha. All right, I don't know where I'm going, actually. Is this the right place? No, there's another battle right there. He doesn't get a lot of counters. Level 70? Let's surf, let's surf. I, outs I know I outspeed it. I'm not gonna let it. I'm not gonna let that fool explode. No, sir. Even though I'm pretty confident now that Lapis can live explosions. <laughs> All right, but anyway, let's keep on going, though. Got a free timer ball. Timer balls are honestly my favorite Pokeballs. Have I already asked you guys what's your favorite Pokeball? I don't think I have. I think that'll be the question of the day. Let's make that the question of the day. If it has been already the question of the day, well, screw it. <laughs> I'll make that a question of the day. What is your favorite kind of Pokeball? Mine is a timer ball. I don't know why, because I always have the best luck with timer balls, because whenever I... Tr I remember it would save my butt. Whenever I would try catching Azel and Yuxi and all that back in Sinnoh. Because I would take so many turns trying to catch those legendaries. And then uh, and then I would just chunk on the timer ball at it. And timer balls, they gain, they become stronger the more turns there are. The more turns there's been in the battle. And so the timer ball would actually help. It actually made me, allow me to catch those, the legendary late trios. So uh, yeah, that definitely... Definitely can't help against a lot of legendaries. So that's why the timer ball is my favorite. But what is yours? That will be the question of the day. I like being prepared for, uh, I like, uh, preparing for, uh, question of the days beforehand. Like, they're actually relevant to the, uh, to the episode. <laughs> but anyway, we're making our way over to our, our old home, but not official home, New Bark Town. Let's actually see what Professor Elm is doing here. Everything's e oh, let's see. No, he has anything to say. <laughs> Alright, but anyway, yeah, we only we had no business here. We're just passing through to go all the way. Is this our encounter? We already have we already have a tentacle, I think though. So I'm gonna go ahead and use a max repel. And let's head on over to Route 27. Do I have a Route 27 encounter? I do not. Route 27 is fair game to catch a Pokemon. Let's get out of here. Alright, what's up, man? Uh, he's not, he just told a long story I didn't care to read. Alright, let's ch check where we are. So we're in Route 27. And we can go on Route 49. And Route 49 is the last route before the Johto League. We might need Waterfall. Oh, please don't tell me I don't need Waterfall. Route 27, let's catch another Pokemans. Oh, there's also a bunch of trainers. Okay. Uh, let's go to Joltik then, since he's the, probably look. They seem like a bunch of water type trainers, or they're just regular, normal. Oh, let's sport. I don't want to. I don't want him to hurt me. I don't think I can OKO it anyway. And oh, oh, I did. I didn't OKO, but I just I made it confused. Oh man. 
Alright, well, what the heck was that? A fury, fury? Follow me. Okay. Well, that would help in a double battle, but we're not in one. But anyway, alright, cool. Line here. See, I don't have any fighting type moves. Wakiki can learn, uh, whatchamacallit. Wakiki's the only one who can learn Brick Break. But, oh well. Let's find where this guy won't kill it. Oh, it does. Dang, Bengal, calm down. Calm down. It's just a game. It's just a game. <laughs> hey, I just finished the battle. Seeking. Oh, I never. Have I caught a Golding? I think I have caught a Golding. I'm about to say, because I'm pretty sure I caught. I caught all the water types you can in this game, so. Surfing as a as a new encounter. Surfing for a new encounter, it won't work with me. <laughs> but anyway, Juwachi is our first Pokemon at level 70. Not bad. I didn't think I'd see on my Pokemon this high level in a playthrough before. That's actually really impressive, not gonna lie. Alright, but anyway, uh, I don't think we need... I don't... I do not think we need all these battles. Let me just battle this guy just in case. Put to sleep before it can infatuate me or anything like that. With a freaking sweet kiss or something. Oh, I forget. Clefable is half fairy type. Alright. Oh, metronome. Oh, okay. If it, I swear, if you get metronome sheer cold or something, I will be mad. <laughs> Alright, what is super effective against... Po it's poison and... Uh, it's just poison and uh, steel that are super effective against fairy types. Two things I don't have anymore. So, uh... Oh, missing sucker. Ha! Cool. Alright, get out of here. Dumb. I hate fairy types, man. I hate fairy types. So where the heck am I supposed to go? Am I supposed to dive? I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to dive then. Alright then, I need a PC ASAP. Professor Elm, if you don't have one, you fail me as a professor. No, you do. <laughs> Alright, cool. Alright, let's move and get Clam Pearl back. And... Alright. I'm sorry, Lapis. <laughs> sorry you're going back into the, into the pound. Alright, Raquel's effect wore off. Okay. I'm about to use one again. Um, so yeah, I have no idea if the Jota League is this way. Unless I didn't need dig for something. Oh no, let's dive. See if we can... No. No. Alright. Let's keep on going. Oh. Alright, so looks like we, we dove in the wrong place. Let's try another way then. Let's try right here. Anything here? No, 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 no. Anything here? Ah, a new place to dive up. Let's go back up. Useless. <laughs> Useless. God dang it. Alright, let's dive here then. Uh, oh. Come on, don't tell me I got dive for nothing. Oh, this is a new place. Is it, are we here? This looks new. Oh, this is new. Let's bet on one person. Why not? Oh, actually, no, we're out of time. So let me finish up this guy. I wanted to get to the Indigo Plateau, or the Johto League. Before I ended off this episode, but I guess not. Oh no, we made it to the Pokemon Center. All right, so that's a good, uh, that's a good checkpoint. So uh, yeah, we got a bunch of exploring done. We got our final gym badge in Johto, and we didn't lose any Pokemon, which is nice, nice, nice. So yeah, that'll be it for this episode. Then so yeah, thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to peck up that like button down below and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. So thank you guys for watching. Once again, I will see you over in the next episode. But until then, stay safe, guys. So burn it down, down.